Hello, YouTube designers, and welcome on to this story. My name is Peter, and on to this story, we're just going to see how we can add this notice that will let customer know that they have purchased this product in the past and if they want to buy it again. This is how it's going to work. Like, for instance, this product has been purchased before, and you see it has this notice that let customer knows that in the past they have just already purchased the product. So, and if they want to order it again, when I just go to my B, now I was here and I just opened the shop. You can be able to see there's so many products that has the notice that this product has been purchased before and with that customer knows they have purchased this product in the previous time and if they want to purchase it again. That's the tutorial for today and without further ado, let's just get into action and I'll show you how. So the first thing we just need to do, we need to head over to the dashboard and on the dashboard menu scroll now. Here we have the button for the plugins and on hofa select add new because you need to install a plugin that will facilitate for us to be able to add the code. So type here snippet. Here we have it. It's called Cold Snippet. It's from Cold Snippet Pro. 600 plus thousand active installation. We install the plugin. And after successful installation, we activate the plugin. Here we have it. Uh, you see we have now the code snippet. And on the dashboard now menu, we have the snippet, select a new, we add the simple code that we've just add or that. So here we just need to give it a name here, I just called user logged in user. For this feature to work, you need to be, the, the user need to be logged in. And after that, we just need to add the code here and add the code, it's just so simple. I have included the link on the description or here you can get this code and from there run the snippet everywhere and we just start save the changes. From that end on here now we need to refresh this page and we see if we have purchased any product in the feed. In the past you see now this product has been purchased before and it has the notice. If we just proceed now to maybe add this product to the cart and we just proceed to check out and do everything as normal that's the normal checkout and all that so i press the order here remember it's brewed the main shop here now we have purchased the product let's see let's head over to the shop uh the shop here and with that you see now it has the notice that shows the product has been purchased in the before and if they want uh, in the past and if they want to purchase the product again Hope you did learn something out of this story. If you did learn something out of this story, hit the thumbs up. If you're new here, consider subscribing. We do more tutorial related to WordPress. And without further ado, let me just say goodbye till next time. Thank you.